Hello and welcome to day 8 of Power World. We're on to our second week. I am the random gamer and we are just going to go to bed before we start the day. I'm going to take a look at the uh, mission box and see what we have to do to upgrade our base. We need a cooler box and a sphere workbench. Okay. I have no technology points, so I gotta level up. I think I'm gonna finish closing up the house today. I know I keep saying about moving the base, but I'm just gonna wait to construct a second one, and we're just gonna make that one in a smarter position. I'm gonna kind of mimic what I did on my main account and just use this one as a farm. Because it's not a bad location to um, make as a farm area for resources mainly, like uh, wool, eggs, and I think like wheat. That would be a good one for the farm. Now we've got the mill, and I'm going to produce, I don't know, a good chunk of fiber here. Say about 22. Got any food cooking? Heck yeah. Alright, let's get some more on the way. I do need more ore though, so let's just double check our inventory for everything and make sure all of our weapons are up to peak. I'm going to finish making the medicine, so that the medical supplies. And then we are going to go, I think, try to find some more pals. Okay, we have one arrow, but nine pal spheres. So that's going to have to work. And perfect, there's a couple daydreams right here. We'll use the lamb ball to start taking them down. Nice. It's just gonna mow him down. Let's try it. Let's try it there. Yeah, Larry. Oh, come on. Really? It was so close. Now he's gonna escape. Oh, yeah. That's gonna be an instant catch. Perfect. Seven more. After we catch this one, it'll only be six. Whoa. That was close. I almost didn't catch him perfect do I need to catch any more of them I don't think so let's try it. do I need you it'll pop up oh pal spear oh yeah we do need to catch more kativas okay well since they are pretty useful we'll just go kind of hunt around for them while we've got the spheres for them. Ooh, okay, cool. 100% catch rate right off the bat. Again, 100%. And we leveled up. See, I told you, getting pals is the number one way to level up. It's just perfect. Now we can unlock. Oh, jeez. Go down here and get the cooler box. We are not ready for the sphere workbench that will be coming soon, but we can get the crossbow. Here's a tip everyone, the crossbow is way too overpowered to use to try to damage them to catch. You have to continue using either the traditional bow and arrow or the melee ones, because the crossbow just kills them in one hit. It's a one hit. That's it. Oh, one more land ball. Let's get it. We'll get the experience bonus right now. Oh, are you kidding me? I murked him. He's just gonna roll down the hill. Just gonna roll on down. Okay, so. Here's another one. 100% catch rate. That's 10 out of 10. Nice. We're going for it. We're almost at level 14. That's impressive. Let's go do some, uh... Some cooking, I guess. He's done. 
bring back some resources because our inventory isn't full. I always recommend if you go out uh, at all, just try to fill up your inventory on the way back with just random crap. Oh, can we catch the dinosaur? I don't think so. No, hold on. We need the Spear Factory for sure. I've tried to catch him lots, and he is difficult. This guy is powerful. I'm gonna stay clear. I have one more pal spear. So let's catch a Cativa, shall we? 100% catch rate. No? Yeah, yeah, we got him. Okay. You, back in your pal sphere. And yet again, I will always apologize, but with Pal World especially, the graphics are just too much for my computer to download, so I have the game stream on Xbox. So I apologize if anyone is annoyed by the screen refresh glitch thing. I don't know what to call it, but it's basically just it refreshing. Oh, we need more ingots. So close. I thought we had this. Okay. Um, why don't we put away some stuff and cook? That's not cooking. Wait. Oh, I don't have it yet. Okay. Man, I really need to start labeling and remembering where, like, where everything is going. Because, like, look at that. It's all jumbled around. It's not right. Why the hell is that in there? I think that should be over here. Yeah. And same with, like, you see, it's all just jumbled. But that's okay. We can fix it slowly. I want to figure this out pretty sure those can stay there that can stay there that can all stay there it's not a big deal all right keeping your base organized is, is definitely a rough task so let's go back with the walls and finally did i put a door yeah i put a door yeah okay yeah okay now let's get the roof finished All right, we have finished our little happy home, and we're just going to put in a mounted torch for lighting. I know once we get up and level, we're going to get the wall torch, so we'll delete this one and put in some wall torches to make it look better, but this isn't too bad. Gives it the amble lighting that we're wanting. Uh, what's this? Metal pickaxe. I'm going to put that away for now. I do not want to lose that or use it yet. Wait. No, not yet. There's no ore. More medical supplies. How many could I make? Four? Sure. I do them in chunks, so don't worry. I just kind of go back and forth when there's nothing to do and do these kind of tasks. So I'll like do half right now, come back, do the other half later. As you can see, there's already one grilled chickpea, and I do need to make sure these guys are fed. Yeah, I thought so. What can I give you? Nothing. Okay, let's put in berries. They like baked berries. We got extra fiber, more berries, raw berries. Is that the advanced workbench? I think so. Oh yeah, because we can craft metal. Man, I'm so mixed up between the two accounts. I've got one that's like super advanced and then there's this one which I'm trying to just push so that I can be that advanced because it's way easier and probably way more entertaining for people to watch, for sure. Let's get these berries growing. Nice, okay. So I would like to craft the metal axe. Now I'll have a full set of metal tools. Uh, what do we need to create the pelt armor? We need more leather. 
I can't remember who gives us leather. Which pal is it? Hmm. I need to think. Maybe it was the, uh... Oh, dear. I think maybe the Lambo? They might give... Actually, I remember now. Thankfully to my fiance, she reminded me. Uh, it's actually more so the horse type creatures that we will see having leather. So maybe we can try and find some. Why are you hungry? Why are you just sitting on the edge of a cliff? Get over here. He's pals, I swear. Look at him, he's limp. What the hell? You limp fuck. Get over there, eat. Why did you go the opposite way? Eat. Oh, he's sleepy now. God damn. Okay, we need to go find ore for sure. So we can craft that stupid cooler box. There is one stat I wish they included in this game. And I want them to include movement speed. Because it would be so much better to be able to walk faster and run faster than you do. It's not that fast, honestly. Yeah, the parachute comes in handy. Let's get some wool and mutton from the lamb ball. Come on, there's no ore around, it's just stone. I think that's ore over there. Hell yeah, made it. Oh! That was a hell of a fall. Do, do, do. We found some. All right. So now we're going to head back to base and turn all that into... Why are you attacking me? You have no shot. Here, face the Kativa. You, you could burst him. Yeah. Do it. There we go. Just knocked out. Okay, let's go back to base and get iron and store all of our stuff. I have yet to actually catch or battle him. I, ba I tried to battle him when I was really young level when I started playing. And I realized very quickly that you cannot until you are at at least level, I want to say 20, 22 maybe, 20, 22. And your pals are at those levels as well, close to 20 at least. It's pretty tough to get them that high up. They'll always kind of stay a couple levels behind you once you get up there, as far as I know. Alright, can we cook anything? Yes. Lambo kebab. Let's start there. And let's put our resources away. Which there's not much of that we can. I don't know what I'm doing now. Okay, we got 42 ore. That is amazing. Let's start there with this. So that'll be 21 ingots in total. Not bad, not bad. And we do need more pal spheres. So we'll start on that. Nice, okay. Gonna finish one more of the medical supplies. Just kind of get that over with while I wait on ingots. Maybe go half to a quarter way on this one. I don't know which pal does medicine production. I can't wait to find one because that will be that'll actually be really useful. And we, as you can see in our pal gear workbench, workbench. I was trying to read the other one before, as I was saying that. Have an Ike. Fire deer saddle and a daydreams necklace, both of which we need more leather and horns and ingots. Bless you, baby. And keep going, finding the ore. Hopefully, the one that's around here has respawned. Um, we're actually gonna switch to our metal tools right now because oh, we do have a metal axe, so let's put the stone one away. And the extra metal one. Stone axe. Oh yeah. I kind of wish I put my door on the other side. I might change where the door is here. And let's put that axe away. And get the metal pickaxe. So we're just going to shuffle everything around real quick. Okay. And boom. Yeah. 
So now all of our older tools are put away and we have an extra metal axe. That's very, very useful. I think this should be respawned by now. If it's not, I don't know what's going on. Yeah, what the fuck is going on? There's no more ore here? Whatever. Let's go find the other one I was mining. I think it was down there? Pretty sure. Oh, you know what? Here's a better idea. Let's get some palladium. Or palladium. I always say the wrong word. Pal, D, M. Why did I do that? I am daft. That was the wrong button. I always do that. I mix up pal sphere button with the uh, attack button all the time. It's just horrible. Alright, 20 paldium. Uh, let's grab the one closest to our base since they were chipping away at it. Hey, look, they just scatter it all around. Lazy pals. Has the chest respawned? Nope. Occasionally, the chest will respawn every, I think, two or three days. So just keep an eye on that alcove if you've made your base here, which I do not recommend. Personally, I recommend making your base more towards this center chunk here. Because it is more centered. You can go that way easier, you could go that way easier. And ultimately, I would not make your second base in this same island. I would move it over here or here. And the reason being is you've got greater distance to travel, greater area to survey, and you're not stuck on this one tiny island like I am on my old account. I'm kind of not really stuck here. I can still fast travel between the waypoints like there. But having a base in and around here probably makes more sense considering there's all sorts of different pals. I want to go through with the medicine. Now that the medical supplies are done, we can put them away into the... I think it was this one here. Yeah, perfect. Medical supplies are usually used. I don't actually know. I tried to heal a fracture on my pal and my other account, and it didn't seem to want to heal with those medical supplies. So I think you need more. Each one has like a use case. Uh, it didn't really tell you, per se, in the menu of crafting them. So you just kind of got to play around and figure out which symptoms are cured by which medicine. But it looks like everyone's getting hungry and tired right now, so let's go feed myself at least. Good. That's good enough. Now, all of my pals have caught up to me kind of in level, so I'm going to swap some out to level up, because as I've said before, you do want to kind of level them up pretty evenly. We're going to swap out who creates with Daydream. Hell yeah. We're going to take a Gumas from Chickpea. Chickpea. And a T-Fan, because I've never actually leveled up any T-Fans before, instead of a Katiba. Now, the next ones. I think we could put the Capriti into the base so that it can mine wood, and we'll take a Celery instead of our Lambo. Now, the net last one, I don't know what to do. Maybe it should be the Pengulet. How about that? A bunch of water, guys. No. Do I have any fire? Nope. That'll be our goal next episode, to find more fire pals, because we definitely need to have more cooking happen. Not what I'm doing there. That's the wrong one. So, I want to craft, say, 10 more cloth. Good. They're harvesting the berries. I think that'll do it for day 8 of Pal World. Thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, stay random.